subscribe to tech me spot channel and press the bell icon and never miss another update hi guys in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to boot windows 10 to safe mode okay guys so i'm going to show you two methods by which you can boot windows 10 to safe mode okay so guys so the first method uh, we have is you need to press windows plus r key on the keyboard to bring this run window and here you need to type this ms config okay and click on this ok button and guys here we have this you know system configuration window on this window you need to click on this boot tab and here we have this boot options uh, so just check this option save boot and let it be default this you know minimal and guys you need to click on this apply button and then ok button and here we have this you know window you may need to restart your computer to apply these changes before restarting save any open files and close all programs okay guys so make sure you do that and after that you just need to click on this restart button okay so guys you can see that it's restarting Okay guys, so we are now on the login screen. Just provide your password and hit enter on the keyboard. You can see guys, we are logging in. As you can see guys, we are now logged in to safe mode. Okay, so you can see over here safe mode. And guys, after that, uh, just do your work, whatever you want to do. And after that, uh, when you're done finishing your work, you just need to press windows plus r key on the keyboard again and you need to type over here ms config and click on this you know ok button and here we have this system configuration click on this boot and just uncheck this option to boot your pc in normal mode okay and after that you just need to click on this apply button and then ok button and then uh, again you need to before restarting save any open files and close all programs okay guys so after that you just need to click on this restart button and you can see guys it's restarting uh, we are now on the login screen guys and just provide your password and hit uh, enter key on the keyboard or you can click over here and we are logging in okay okay guys so the first method is done and let's try you know the second method okay so uh, you need to press this shift key on your keyboard and click on this start button and click on this you know power and you need to uh, click on this you know restart okay i'm still holding the shift key still holding this shift key and guys uh, i got this you know window okay so i'm just releasing the shift key okay so it's now released and after that guys uh, you you have various options over here like continue troubleshoot turn off your pc uh, just click on this you know troubleshoot okay and here we have this you know troubleshoot reset this pc or we have this advanced options so just click on this advanced options and here we have this advanced options over here so you need to click on this startup settings over here okay and here we have this startup settings restart to change windows options such as here we have various options and also we have the enable safe mode okay so just click on this restart button okay guys so here we have this you know startup settings and press a number to choose from the options below okay so here we have this uh, options over here and use the number keys or function keys f1 to f9 okay so suppose if i want to select this enable safe mode i need to press the f4 key or you know the number key okay that is four okay so i'm pressing f4 and guys you can see that it's booting into the safe mode We are now on the login screen just provide your password and click over here and you can see guys we are logging in and we are now logged in 
into the safe mode okay guys so here you can see that safe mode over here okay guys so after you are done uh, uh, doing your work in safe mode just click on this start button and you need to click on this bar and click on this you know restart as you can see guys it's restarting we are now on the login screen provide your password we are now logged in in normal mode okay guys so in this way you can easily boot your windows 10 computer to safe mode by using these two methods so that's it guys thanks for watching if you like my videos please support this channel by subscribing to it thanks bye bye